Thanks for inviting us in. It's now six o'clock and tonight police are investigating a triple shooting at a hotel on the northwest side of Indianapolis. One person was killed today, two others injured. IMPD calls it an isolated incident. Right now, they have no suspects in this shooting. Our Emily Long Longnecker joins us tonight. She's got the questions that police are still trying to answer. Emily. Well, Scott, yeah, police have been here all day trying to figure out what led to this shooting. Now, they know that there was some kind of disturbance in a room on the third floor of this hotel before the shooting happened. But one question they're still asking, was there a shootout in this room or is it, was it just one person with a gun inside that's responsible? What they do know is that when the shooting was over, one man was dead and two more people, a man and a woman, were critically injured. There's one still on the floor and he ain't going nowhere. JJ Smith heard the shooting across the hall and called 911 while taking cover on the floor. He says two bullets came right through the wall of his room. He only came out when the gunfire stopped and he knew police were across the hall. Minutes later, they secured the two that were still alive and there's one still laying up there. I seen, I seen him when I went up to the room just a minute ago. Smith says he also saw a fourth person in the room where the shooting happened, a woman who appeared to be okay. At this point, police have no suspects in the case, but say the public is not in any danger. And at this point, police are not releasing the name of the man who died or the people who are injured. They've been here all day, still trying to figure out what led to this shooting. Scott? Yeah, we know you'll keep asking questions until you get answers. Emily, thanks so much.